Hi, this is Rachel Stone with CCT in Richmond, Virginia, and I'll demonstrate creating a meeting using the scheduling assistant in Outlook 2013. I'm currently in my calendar view in my work week view for my current week and I know the meeting I'd like to schedule will be the week of June 20th. So I'm going to go select that week on my little mini calendar preview here and now I can see that week and I'd like it to be on June the 21st sometime around 10 o'clock. So I'm going to go ahead and double click that time here and notice it automatically populates my start and end time um, with the 21st and it gives me that time slot which is 10 to 1030. Now this is something I'm going to change but this was just a good place for me to start from. And I first want to start by inviting my meeting attendees. So I'll click this invite attendees button and as soon as I do that, notice it reveals the To button so I can choose who from my contacts or my global address book to invite. So I'll click To and I'll select um, a couple of names here from the list. Notice I double click them so they're next to my required field. You could also include them as optional or as resources. If you have a conference room that is set up as a contact or as a user in your list, you would go ahead and add them at this time. And click OK. And now I'll choose the scheduling assistant to look at when this might meeting this meeting uh, could occur. And I can see I've got a meeting uh, here, and another person has a meeting at this time block. So I think between uh, let's say between 10 and 11 should be good. Now I've already got 10 selected, so I'm going to drag to expand this to 11. But I could easily move these bars to select any time frame I want. Now let's say I change my mind and I'd like to do the afternoon. I'll come over here and select the 4 or 4.30 time slot. Maybe resize that a bit and choose something towards the end of the day. But let's go back and go with, let's say, uh, I think about an hour and a half for this meeting. So we'll go from 10 to 11.30. That looks like it's good for everyone. Now I'm going to go back over to my appointment tab because I need to add some details to this meeting such as the subject which will be social media marketing marketing and I'll tell them this is conference room B and then below I would add any notes or details about what this meeting is about uh, so people know what to expect when they come to this meeting or if I have a meeting agenda I could copy and paste that in at this time I'll go ahead and uh, hit the send button to send that message and then my recipients will get it and they'll either accept or reject this meeting request. And that's how you schedule a meeting in Outlook 2013. Thanks so much for watching.